Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. So today we're doing Terriamon's exclusive scoop. Uh, I want Digimon to be better friends of humans, that's why I need a secret human scoop. Okay, let's go for it. What's he gonna want? Please don't talk too long. Uh, you must be the detective in charge. When the interdimensional wall broke down, I was sent from the digital world to this one. Right now there are Digimon in this world that are afraid, don't know where they are, and think of humans as their enemies. I'd rather not see humans as an enemy. I'd still like to think there is a way that humans and Digimon can coexist peacefully. But I didn't know what to do. So that's when I heard about you guys and how you've solved many problems for Digimon. So I'd like to examine you in detail. Please show me all the good that humanity has to offer. Um... Okay... Really? Hooray! Thank you so much! Merman, sorry to interrupt, but I know it's sudden, but there's another case I'd like you to take. It seems someone has run out of, on a bill of a restaurant in Shibuya. The restaurant staff are asking for help in tracking down the perpetrator. It's been a while since you had a case uh, fit for a detective. Please handle this one as well. When she was like, I thought she was just saying it's been a while since I've had a case. I've been like, I've done 20 bloody cases. Ah, you're the detective, aren't you? Please fight this way. I sent in a request. I work in the cafe. Please, I need your help tracking down and arresting the criminal who ran out without paying. Earlier today, at around 2pm, a diner took up and left without paying for their meal. I was here in the cafe with my husband. As usual, I was dealing with the customers and my husband was cooking. Then, I think it was about 5 minutes to 2 when I went out the back door to go and phone my friend and I left my husband in charge of the cafe. While I was on the phone, I heard a voice cry from inside the cafe. It said, Dine and Dash! So I immediately hung up and went back into the cafe. But when I got inside, my husband wasn't there. He had run out of the cafe after the criminal. Before I went out for the phone call, there had been more than 20 customers in the cafe. But when I heard the shout and came back in... What is happening? One second, someone's calling me. Go away. Um, when I heard the shout and came back in, four of the customers had gone. As I thought my husband had gone after the criminal, I entrusted the cafe to a regular I knew and went out looking for the missing customers. Wow! Were you able to find the four missing customers in such a short amount of time? Honestly, I just got lucky. Oh, here they are. The Dine and Dash occurred about five minutes after I went out the back to make the phone call. These customers must have left during that time. I'm good with faces, it's sort of a talent of mine. They even admit that they were all in the cafe. So, I talked to each of them and listened to their stories, but I can't work out who it was. I'm sure one of them must be the criminal, but... So please go and ask each of them about this and catch the criminal. Surely the only one who was lying would be the criminal. Therefore, you have no reason to lie. Please investigate this crime. Okay, I wasn't really, like, remembering things that she was saying, so we'll see how it goes. There was another person named Yotsuya who left about the same time as I did. No one behind the till, so I didn't know where to leave my money. But she left it by the register, so I did too. Then I followed her out of the cafe. I also heard someone shout about the dying dash, but I don't know who. It sounded like a man's voice. One man shouting once. So, she's saying she paid. She supposedly paid as well. The dying dash happened at 2pm exactly, right? At that time, I'd almost finished and had got up to go to the restroom. I returned and heard it's a dine and dash and there was commotion in the cafe. It had nothing to do with me, so I put my money back down and left. Yeah, the shouting voice was definitely the waiter. Ni Nishio is not the criminal. She's a, a beautiful woman. I fell in love with her as soon as I first saw her and I spent my entire lunch eating cheap spicy curry and staring at her. But after some shouting out it's dine and dash, Nishio left the cafe. The criminal obviously ran out of the cafe before the shout. I was the one who yelled out, it's a diamond dash, the cafe owner, a man who heard me when running after the criminal. I was curious about the diamond dash, so after that I went straight up to the counter, placed the money there and then left. I could only see the criminal from behind. It was a woman, I tried to run after her too, but I lost sight of both the waiter and the criminal. So I think, is he the only one that didn't say he paid? Um... Hmm... I have no idea who it is. How is it going? Do you know who the criminal is? Um. Let's talk to Terry, Mom. 
What do you say? Oh, well, now I'm a bit confused. It's hard for me to follow. But whenever you don't understand something, you just need to hear it several times and make a note of it, I guess. We need to find the two people whose stories don't match. Okay, so what did she say? Uh, dash. Oh, wait, no, she's saying she's Yoda as a Dynam Dash. The cat had my own running out of the criminal. No, I was curious about the Dynam Dash, so after that, I went straight up to the counter, placed the money there, and then left. I can't see the criminal from behind. It was a woman. I tried to run after her, too, but I lost sight of both the waiter and the criminal. Wait, she didn't say that last time, did she? What do you want? What is the meaning of Indian summer? I don't know that, maybe. Um, I think it's this lady. There was another person named Yotsuya who left about the same time as I did. No one behind the tills, so I didn't know where to leave my money, but she left it by right, so. And she said the diamond dash yellow was definitely a man, right? Oh, the waiter, you say. I think it's this lady, yes, blame her and see what happens. Actually, we could just save, couldn't we? And then if we get it wrong and there's actually some kind of problem with that, we can just load and do it again. And now we get to see how much... Oh, I didn't tell you, yeah, I did loads of training. Because I think I can beat that loose same one with a different team. But I can't get it until I do some more missions. Yes, I do. Really? Please tell me who it was. The criminal is who? I think it's Nishio. Huh? Well, my man, that's odd, because I think I have a hunch about who it might be. Hmm, I think the criminal is Ishira. Huh? Why me? What? I never did any such thing. If you think I'm the criminal, let's hear your explanation. Well, let's see. Out of the four customers, two of their stories most definitely didn't match. Isn't that right, my man? Was the waitress really on the phone? Was the man who shouted the waiter or Ishiro? Is Senpai's love on a sheen? Uh, that one, I guess. Yes, well done. Just what I expected from you, my man. Among the four people, there is conflicting testimony. Who actually shouted to Dion Dash? Was it the waiter or Ashira? In that case, you would know your husband's voice. Well, as well as you hear him all the time, right? I'm sorry, I just heard a loud voice cry out suddenly. I can't remember if it was my husband's or not. Oh, I see. In any case, it's strange that Ashira said he was the one who shouted out, whereas Yotsuya claimed it was the waiter. So that must mean one of them is lying, which means one of them is probably the criminal, right? Yeah, but you you can make the same assumption about that bloody woman that I said it was. She said she shouted it, so up your tear him on. Wait, but then, why are you accusing me and not that Yotsuya woman? Well, hmm, that's... Merman, do you know? Uh, Nishio's testimony must be correct. Oh, we'll say that one. Yes, that's right. Hehe, <laughs> you're really something. So basically, we should trust in the Shio and Senpai's testimony, right? Yes, according to the Shio, there was only one shout, so we can't have been both Ishira and the waiter. According to Senpai, the Shio left the cafe right after the Nine Dash happened, and the Shio and Yotsuya left the cafe at almost the same time. So essentially, there is no one who can back up Ishira's story. Yotsuya's alibi is backed up by Nishio's and Senpai's, and there's not the criminal. And they're not the criminal, so we can believe them. That means Yasuya can't be the criminal. The criminal said the opposite of what Yasuya said. Yasuya told us the waiter shouted, but the one who said he shout himself shouted out was the criminal is Ashira. Don't don't talk such nonsense. I was definitely the one who shouted out. I called out to the other customers in the shop to warn them about what the stupid jerk was doing. I already told you I ran out after the criminal. Why are you blaming me? You should be thanking me. Huh. <sighs> Oh dear! I'm sorry, I couldn't catch the criminal. The criminal is here, it's this guy! You? You're the one who died and dashed! Um... Ah, Mr. Policeman! This guy here is the one who ran out on the check! This young boy ran out on the check in your restaurant? Right then, he's coming down to the station with me. Case closed! Wow, my man, you really are as good as they say! Right, back to the office. I'm sure Kyoko will want to congratulate you on your job well done. You there. Hold it for a second. You're the one who tracked this criminal down. Wow, that's amazing. Quite the feat indeed. Thank you for your help in catching this diamond dasher. Or whatever I'm done with this, huh? Hehe, <laughs> you're such a bunch of chumps. Huh? What is this? 
Great job working that out. Unfortunately, it doesn't matter. Don't you get it yet? The policeman is a diamond dasher. How about now? I'm not a real cop. But haha, <laughs> oh, you should see your faces. We are members of the much talked about your boy the light gang. Members of the light love the thrill of getting away with crimes again and again, and we're impossible to catch. But that's. You mean you actually enjoy running out on checks at restaurants doing bad stuff and deceiving everyone? Tip of the iceberg, idiot. You really think that'd be enough to satisfy us? You embarrassed us, and you're gonna pay for that. We have all our revenge. First, I'm gonna spread a rumor around that you couldn't catch the guy who did the diamond dash. Best detective around, I don't think so. But such a roundabout kind of revenge won't be enough for us. Catch me if you can. If you can't, we're gonna keep doing bad stuff. <gasps> they got away. Where do you think those guys are going? I heard something... Uh, a gang of thugs who always cause trouble around the neighborhood. Hang on to the Jabuya subway station. But don't even think about going after them. It's too dangerous. Those guys are criminals, so we should leave this to the police. Here is your fee. Please don't be shy. You did a great job tracking down the criminal. Hmm, I guess I'm a little worried about what that guy said about a revenge. I know what it is. Revenge is when someone does something bad to you, so you do something bad back to them in return, right? Why would he say such a thing about it? Uh, such a thing, though. It wasn't our fault he got arrested. It was just his own fault for doing all those bad things. Nothing good ever comes from getting back at someone. Anyway, sorry, sh we, uh, should we go after these guys? Okay, let's do it. We're off to Shibuya subway station. These guys are trying to use Digimon for evil purpose, says. <laughs> they are probably abusing them all the time. We never use humans for anything. I never want to have that kind of relationship with a human. Uh, let's get over there and show these guys. What the hell? Get off! I wonder if those guys are in here. Let's go. Um, no, I don't care. Uh, I'm actually going to load quickly and see if it makes a difference if I say the other thing and get the right person. Okay, so getting the answer right, all it did was change um, uh, the prize that I got, which was a like, medical spray instead of a health spray. So no, it didn't really make a difference. What's going on around here? Mm -hmm. At the moment I've got all three of these guys in my team because we never really know what we're going to end up fighting. I might as well have one of each of my reasonably hard hitters. It would be my hard hitters if it weren't for Plessiomon. <laughs> Poor dear. Um, just do that, that'll probably kill them. There we go. Got some mad experience from that battle. Um, let's try this way quickly. Oh, I don't know what the point of this area is at all. This is the normal attacks, I'll probably beat them up doing that. Yeah, basically. Do it with you directly. There we go. I'll test it one's quite cute. Um, I don't think this is going to be the right way, but let's go this way anyway. I wonder what we're going to fight as the last dude for this thing. I thought this would be a quite a short mission, but no such luck. I think this is going to take us into the back of the CD store, actually. Which is not where we want to be. But, um, what can you do? Do Terra for... No, that's a waste of time. Do nothing. You do Terra Force or Dark Terra Force. And then you do a normal attack and that'll probably beat it. Yay. Da -da 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 -da. I know dear. Um I don't know where this is going. Uh, do the same thing again. Dooby dooby doo. Okay, now is this gonna be a dead end? 
Oh no, apparently not. What I might actually do is put on no enemies because it's not really worth having them. And it's just annoying. Great, so that was a dead end. Well, there we go. Let's go back then. I'm hoping this high alert thing counts for multiple areas. I can't remember if it actually does. Because it's just not worth us fighting these idiots. We're not getting any experience from it. Oh god, this area is long. Cool. Should we go straight down, I guess, and then if that doesn't take us somewhere, we'll go back to the original room. That's a dead end down here, isn't it? Cool, let's go back then. Well... As much as this area I think has been cleaned out from last time we were here, it's always good to check the other locations to make sure we're not missing anything. Do, do, do. Um, up here. Let's go further along and check here. Have a look. There's a door back there, does that go anywhere? No. Let's try going up here. No, in my luck, this will lead nowhere at all. Let's go all the way to the end. Mm. Maybe an open chest. Yep. Where are we now? <laughs> oh my god, this place is a nightmare. Empty chest, yep, great. Do, do, do. Oh well guys, we're nearly finished this game now, assuming these great challenges aren't a complete nightmare, which they probably will be, but we'll see what happens. It's quite lazy that basically they just reuse these same areas over and over again to save out on having to design more of them. So then it's just loads and loads of space that's completely pointless because there's nothing here. Because we already got it all. But it doesn't surprise me particularly, this game is pretty terrible. Um, should we just assume it's down here that it wants me to go? It probably isn't, but let's have a look. Are they here? Oh no, they are here, cool. There probably were other places I could go and get stuff, but... Oh well, let's just go fight these idiots. Oh, well, game almost changed sides. Well done, you managed to find us. To be honest, you guys just came here to be defeated by, by us. Well done anyway. You guys use Digimon, don't you? Well, we have to be hackers too, so let's go. We are the better Digimon masters, as you will see. Here, I brought this guy along with me. Use it to fight this guy. What? Oh, finally! This one is the only one that really makes sense to be in this area. Grand Locomon, because he's a big train. But finally, he's here on the tracks. Cool. Bring it on. Ground Locomon, I'm pretty sure that's not what it's meant to be called. Ground Locomon! This Digimon I found around here recently, after we had a little chat or two with him, he became a nice, obedient little slave. The pride of delight has been in solid. Avenge me, little Digimon, put the hurt on that. Come and then ground Logomon. Speed charge, that's annoying. Um, what is he? He's normal. So let's... I also noticed that I guess I must have misclicked once and gone into editing the name of one of my Black Greymon, or Black Wall Greymons, but Black Wall Greymon's name is too long for a nickname, so it just defaulted it to Black Wall Grey. So we'll just have to have Black War Grey from now on. And we'll live with it. Well. Do whatever you want, love. You're not going to live much longer. 
Okay, maybe I need to do a bit more damage than that. Let's go for a destruction cannon one, that'll probably kill him. Or not. Okay, his defense actually must be really good. Oh, it's quite a cool attack. So I'm glad we got to see this, even though it's quite long. Alright, oh, Nox back. Oh, hi, Cherrymon! Oh, it would have been so funny if Terry wanted to kill him. Anyway, let's just do Black Tornado again then, because we know it's definitely going to get him. Cool. Oh, he didn't disappear. How strange. Yeah, Terry was just like, yeah! Uh oh. Oh, that's sad. Oh, Crown Locomon! Ah, uh, please don't kill me. Wh what? But that doesn't make any sense. How could that Digimon be defeated so easily? Never. I'll never forgive you. Digimon are not tools for you uh, to use. We were flung into this world. We don't know every day what we don't know. Every day we struggle with terror and fear. There are Digimon being terrorized by humans, but there are also Digimon who believe there can be friendship between humans and Digimon. That ground Locomon probably fought that. Humans are humans are... Terrymon, not all humans are like that. Uh, Merman? That's true, you're not like that, Merman. You help any human in who is in this world, and even Digimon like me as well. We haven't spent much time together, but even so I know. You're a kind and warm-hearted Merman. Like Merman said, give yourself up to the police. Reflect on what you've done and set it right. Even people like you can turn things around, so I'm going to try to trust in you. Y y yes I will leave immediately. Well, I guess this has turned out well then, wouldn't you say? Not really, Ground Locomon blew up. <laughs> well, my man, I think that about does it for my case. You know, the reason I picked you wasn't just because you're a capable detective. I wanted to make friends of humans, but I myself was afraid of them, so I asked you guys because you had a good reputation among Digimon. Humans like those guys and I will never understand each other. Some part of me will always be afraid and never want to be around them. But when I see you, I understand. Whether it's a Digimon or a human, you have a way of looking at something and get, uh, someone and gaining their trust. So I'd like to be able to look people in the face and to be honest, like you. And I'd like to be able to make friends without being afraid. More than that, I want to go out and tell the Digimon of the world that there are humans like you, that they don't need to be afraid. And finally, I would like to ask you something, my man. My hand may be small, but Pinky promise? Promise me, who, however hard it may be, you will never give up. You will create friendship between Digimon and humans and do your very best. Here's a promise. Yeah. <laughs> well, anyway, it was really awesome how you dealt with that case, my man. Thanks. Okay, I'm off then. See you later. What a loser. Let's hand that in and then we'll call it a day. Well, looks like things went just like the client hoped. You and Terramon have both really grown up a lot, I feel like. Chicken tonight. Um, let me find out what that thing I just got actually does. What was it that we got for doing that? Like, master, master disc, what does that do? Oh, that's pretty bloody good. I've got five of them. Why well, have I been using them? <laughs> what does an average uh, thing do up? Does that actually say? Oh, okay, that does do quite a lot. Oh, I'm an idiot. It says right here what all these things do. Um, even still, that master thing is pretty good. If I want to boost all my stuff. Uh, what was the other thing I got? I got like a master defender or something. Anyway, if you enjoyed what you saw, like and subscribe, and come back next time and we will start beating up these uh, royal knights. Anyway, see you later. Bye-bye.